before you wankers cry about this gameplay starting late, listen to me, right? Listen to me. The game started late because of the host migration, and this is all he saved. So, with your tits out of the water now, we can proceed with the commentary. Great. So, I have one topic about this video. That's why I proceeded to do it, and I don't know if music's going to go on. It depends on how long the topic lasts. You know, I'm at the stage of my cold where it makes my voice deeper, and I like it because it makes me feel like I'm a beast. But other than that, I'm okay. And this is a hardcore domination gameplay. 6v6 on the map studio. I'm about to cough. Let's try and keep it in. This map is a remake of the map from uh, Black Ops 1 Firing Range, everyone's favorite map. Why they had to make it into a hipster fag fest, I don't know. But y they could have just left it as it was, but they have to make it new and refreshing like they did in Black Ops 1 with Cliffside. They made it look like a fag fest. It, it's, it's a beautiful map, right? But I like the old dramatic style that I played in a game that only had two days played. So it really didn't matter there. Uh, this is <laughs> shit. This is by Go with a t Tie. Go with the TY. Go with the tie. Same thing. He is a uh, beast to getting these hardcore Dom double nukes. I think he has two more that I haven't uploaded. One on Aftermath, the other one hijacked. Hijacked one's uh, good, but it isn't special. Wait. Wait. Wait, hold on. This isn't hardcore. Never mind. This is not hardcore. I, I thought it was, but it apparently isn't. In the beginning, you of course saw the nuke. I, I hope you got that out of your face. If you didn't see it, go back and listen to my great intro again just to express my feelings about that. So this is actually core, sorry about that, I wasn't, at, even though it was HUDs everywhere in front of me, I still couldn't uh, depict whether it's core or not, usually he does hardcore, but this one isn't! So this is exciting, it's a core, actually it's hardpoint too, which is, uh, whoops, man, I'm, I'm getting all my information wrong. So this is multi-team hardpoint, double nuke on studio, first one in the world, woohoo, I hate saying world's first. Anywhere, it's just like I'm bragging about having cancer or something. It's just not something you want to say. So, oh well. So, what's the topic? is about the next Xbox. Woo! You know, I don't do PS3 because I don't even have one. Don't care about it. Free online makes all the makes all the hippies come out of nowhere. I don't care. So, the next Xbox called Infinity. It's been confirmed and also leaked at the same time. While they support it with the logo that looks super beast. Now I'm not going to put it up because I wasn't prepared for this video, so you can go on Yahoo, you know, go to news and just look it up, you'll find it there. And what uh, I, and the also is something that everybody's been waiting for, it's like, ah, yeah, 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 that supposedly will, supposedly would have committed suicide for the next Xbox, which was, uh, the, what's it called, the all, always on function, they got rid of it. So no more of that, because I guess people have a problem with always being on, I see virtually nothing bad about it but whatever you know people have those 1.3 megabyte download speeds rolling they got that walmart connection what so it's it's got eight gigabytes of ram you know a great uh graphics card really great of course the ps4 is a little bit better but i at the at the uh i think it plays blu-ray it's still not confirmed if it plays blu-ray but when you have a graphics card that it's four times as powerful as a 1080p and then you hear someone say I'm getting PS4 let's say they're an Xbox fan because it has better graphics I really want to pull my teeth out and make them into a big finger saying F you because what you're buying a console for better graphics honestly the Xbox and PS4 and my first glance not PS4 the, uh, seven, the 360 and the PS3 both have the same graphics to the human eye, to my eye at least. I've seen them both, trust me. I go to Best Buy once in a while. I'm outside. So, I, I, I'm seeing no difference. There's no visible difference that you can see for an ordinary person. I mean, I'm pretty sure there is a little difference. You know, maybe like one more pixel. But there isn't something so big. So that people actually use the excuse PS3 has better graphics. By fact, it does because it has a higher graphics card processor. But the graphics truly are not that much dramatic. I mean, you could pick up a little detail here and there. But it isn't something that you're going to... That uh, Helen Keller will notice. You know, it's it's not huge. So the PS4 and the Xbox, even even more so, because the Xbox is and the PS4 are gonna have full 1080p quality, while these only have like 480p or some bullshit amount that it just stretches the quality. Uh, and so what, once you have that, you really cannot tell the difference whatsoever, unless you're good enough and you have 20 over 1 trillion vision. Oh wait, wait, wait. Reverse that. 1 trillion over 20 vision, not 2020. And you can actually pick that out. And please tell me. 
if you can see that single pixel more, even though it's probably like a trillion pixels more. I'm not too much into that kind of network, not really networking. Just electronics, I don't know it very well. So there's, so there's no reason to uh, say I'm going to get this console over that one because it has better graphics or, you know, it's, I can't really argue with anything else, like, I mean, if a, if a console has better games, of course, get that. But if the console has absolute shit online, a horrible uh, community, then def definitely. I mean, every car, every game has a horrible community. It's really only the small games that really have good ones, unless somebody can pinpoint a, a great community for a game. I know COD has the worst community known to man. I mean, it's like everyone's wrapped in a concentration camp. There is nothing good about the community. Even I, even I'm uh, unabashed abstinence. I don't even know what that means. It sounded cool. So you know. The cock community is horrible. Everybody, you, you, you see a guy using a, what's it called? Let's see, a, uh, an AR-15. An AN-94. An AR-15 is not a cock. You know, all your noobs, you're such an overpowered gun. I mean, that's me. But still, I mean, there's no still. I'm going super hypocritical on this. Yeah, it's a horrible community. Everyone makes fun of each other. You get 100 plus, somebody says, oh, you're not facing good people. Well, we've set out a challenge. Uh, not me specific, specifically. But we have a... Uh, to get a nuke in the league, I think a few people have done so. One person, Scooby Snackers, has he has gotten a triple nuke before. He supposedly got a 56 kill nuclear. I think not lethals or maybe small lethal kill streaks. Look at that quad feed. Woo! This is such a beast. He supposedly got a great gameplay in league. Now you know if you made it this far through the controversy I've been going through, please give us a challenge. I've been wanting to employ challenges. You know, not really enforce them where everyone has to do them specifically, but definitely the I can do challenges now too. Woo! I feel like the big boy with my two double nukes. I'm, I'm going, I'm going ham, right? Today, I mean, I've never done worse in a COD game today. I've just been playing horribly. Anyone who beat me who thought they were good, just hand over your dick and say no because really, I was doing horrible. If you want to see my games today, oh, just look at my freaking recent games. I felt like handicapped person. See, look at this map. A fucking UFO going into a building, like. Is that not distracting enough for you? I'm shooting bullets. I mean, he's got this camo on the gun that I really can't stand. But, I mean, it doesn't take away from the gameplay. If you enjoyed this, uh, great shit, then, uh, it's not great shit. It's amazing shit. It, yep, remove shit. It's great. Then leave a like and subscribe!